going on everybody welcome back Kellen here from droid life so tonight we got gingerbread droid x 2.3.3 new moto blur you know all sorts of goodies going on there uh, we're gonna get through you know a full walkthrough of blur in a second but what we wanted to do first was jump in and show you guys some actual benchmarks uh, we're hoping to see some significant increases from uh, uh, 2.2 to 2.3 you know we went from big jumps from 2.1 to 2.2 so hopefully we'll get those same results going to from 2.2 to 2.3 uh, first we're going to do Linpack for whatever reason um, OMAP processors hate these Linpack tests so we're not going to expect too much you can see I ran it before and there was 12.53 or something M flops and you know the anything with a Snapdragon gets like in the 40s or 30s or something like that so you can see that was a 10 we're not going to get anything here. You know, I don't necessarily know how these benchmarks work and, you know, the dirty details of them, but as you can see, we're getting 10s. I had a 12 up there. Linpack, you know, not really expecting much. We are going to run Quadrant right after this and uh, hopefully hoping to see some uh, significant results there. So 10 again. Okay, so Linpack, whatever. Let's go ahead and move on to Quadrant now. Quadrant Standard. Let's go ahead and run full Benchy and uh, see what we can get here. And as you can see, I don't really have anything running in the background. It's not syncing. Um, there are some notifications up there, but those are I'm pretty sure about battery and um, DLNA stuff, so not really worried about that. Let's see what we can do, though. Um, and so you know, I have my Droid 2 up and uh, also cooking around on uh, Gingerbread. You see there's the new, uh, new notification bar and all that stuff. So we're going to walk through you know, both of these. You know, and if I was a really good blogger, I would have had Quadrant on here, and we could have, like, dueled out and see which one scored higher. But I'm just not that good right now, so let's go ahead and push that aside. We'll get back to that later. So let's see what we can get here. Almost finished with the benchmark. I'm not going to lie, I cheated a little bit. I did run this once, and I did get a pretty, pretty impressive number. Alright, let's see what we get. And, in case you can't see that, it says almost 1800. So, over the Nexus 1 with 2.2, you know that's obviously an older device, but you can see down here, Droid X on 2.2, you know, we're getting just barely over a thousand, maybe 1100. On 2.3, same exact phone, we are getting 1796 and I ran it before and I got 1825 so that number is pretty ridiculous um, gotta be pretty impressed with that there so anyway there's your benchmarks 2.3.3 it's actually the newest Android build blur all that stuff you can get we're gonna do a full walkthrough in just a little bit just wanna give you benchmarks for now anyway check out the blog we're gonna have tons of coverage of Android 2.3 on the Droid X and we're out droidlife.com peace